Hey buddy, yo, what is up? We are back with the offline recording YouTube videos. Just for you, baby. Let's go. So we're playing a normal game, but listen, I know, I know, normal game blade, well, you know, it's so easy, blah, blah, blah. But what you don't know is I've won so many normal games that my MMR is literally diamond level. So I'm basically playing against diamond players, except they tilt easier here because it's normal. So they don't give a crap. But yeah. I do need to level this account because I want to, well, tomorrow or so, I need to go another unranked to challenger in 5 days or so. I'm traveling to EU October 9th, so I just want to try hard on this account, see what rank we can get to. Maybe transfer it to EU and E, and then we go from there, baby. We'll see how it goes. Let's do it up, baby. Let's do it up. So we have Rain Top, we have Jax, I'm playing Echo Jungle. I'm taking Conquer, Presence of Mind, Tri I mean Tenacity, Coupe de Grey, Sudden Impact, and Revenant Hunter. These rooms are really good, especially Presence of Mind, so good. My build on Echo is usually tank. That's what the Challenger Echo player does. And now, well, my build now, baby. That's all I'm saying. Too late. I have better leash than that. Ah, right, not too bad, not too bad. Let's queue this, so I get both marks, perfect. Perfect. Okay, I might get a little unhealthy here actually. Nah, I should be fine. Wow, did Jax just kill that guy? Okay, whatever, one crack doesn't matter. I don't want to use my Q right there. Okay, let's do this. Go, go, go. So we just gotta clear the waves. Do your jungle camps. This is usually the easiest path to do on Echo Jungle. You're not that strong like early levels, but from now on, I clear so healthy. This guy wants assistance as a Ziggs vs Syndra. That's just not gonna work, my friend. That would literally just be a waste of my time to listen to that gang. Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna go mid. No way. I wanna clear my jungle. Do scuttle if I can. Top lane should be gankable, maybe. He has no flash. Yeah, if anything, top lane's the only one. Let's use a pot. It's about time we use some pots. Ooh, cancel the auto. Let's use smite so I do extra damage. Your W passive does extra damage to that. This could actually work. No, I'm so sad it didn't. I might be able to kill them anyways. Oh, that's actually tragic, I know. I want them to engage on me first, to be honest. Oh, if that reached. Okay, whatever. Can't kill Aga. Oh, that was so close of killing him too. Okay, our retired team is dying. So we have to probably scale. It's fine. I'm playing Echo Jungle. I actually can't lose on this champ. It's so strong, I feel like. But at least I got a KP right there for free. Which sort of sucks. I keep forgetting your Hunter's Talisman does damage at the end. Okay, let's back. Reset the Krugs. Farm it up. I think the lead soon is going to be... Wow, he's actually passing back topside. That's very interesting. This is not a good idea for me to gank this lane. You should just survive if you can. I'm gonna go straight to his bot scuttle and take that. And then I'll have double scuttle on him. I'll out CS him, and then once I get level 6, I can start fighting people, killing everyone. Dude, he's pinging when the guy's at like full HP. Buddy. No, no, I actually griefed that. I need to smite this. It's gonna take too much. Uh, maybe not. Oh my gosh. Stop. That went so delayed. He keeps pinging instead of focusing. It's crazy. He's just gonna die. Okay, whatever. We need someone to freaking wave. He can't push it fast enough now. 
All these lanes are impossible to gank early on. Actually, Bolling should be the only lane. Yeah, that guy looks killable. Oh dear, this is gonna be hard, sort of. Die, oh, please. Thank you. Thank God he actually autoed back. I would not be able to kill him. Yo, the really good thing is, I get my item here. Once I do these two jungle camps, that item's huge. It's the only way we can do a lot of damage. And carry this. I want to save my Q so I can actually do it on this. I should use my W earlier on this minions. I use it so bad. Not necessary at all anymore. Nice, I get that double mark. Okay, perfect. Got the item. Time to back. Reset to top side. Screw the bot scuttle. There's no way I can get that. I have 50 CS, he has 20. I think he has more than 20, but he hasn't showed himself, so... It shows us 20. My flash is coming 40 seconds, that means... I think this guy's flash is up. Wayne's gonna struggle so much in this lane. She's getting behind in the Jax lane. Never had luck. Never but I could easily kill the Jax. But the thing is, if you go 2v2, I think we lose. And the Lee Sin's just hovering that 24-7. So I can't afford to, you know, be there with him and then we both die. That could be tragic if he end up doing that. Let's get this. Okay, now we can kill the top. Wow, that damage is insane. Where is he going? Let's go, baby. Okay, we take this. I want to make sure that guy doesn't kill this guy. Okay, we need to push this wave. The vein can't really push it fast. There we go. Alright, good enough. Now I can maybe gank mid. Let's see. At least someone's nearby. Yeah, no, we can't gank that shit. No. They all died. Sheesh. I might do my mercs. I have my 20% tenacity. Just get more... Magic resist, or tenacity rather, and they cannot hit you at all. Alright, we have 2kp. That bot skull is gone, there's no way I can contest it. Bolden should be easy to gank. I'm gonna go back, bot. Ooh, I should go right now. I think they know. Okay, yeah, sadly they know. Let's see if I can kill in the mid lane. Pop, pop, pop. Go around. This way it's not gonna work. Ooh, baby. Okay, whatever. Flash or flash. And I kill one. I get flashed. Almost had the other guy too, though. Oh, if I got the other one too, it would be so good. I'm gonna smite this for HP. I have one ganked up. It's easily gankable. He doesn't see me on this thing. Okay. Let me give him one Q so he can push away fast, actually. If he can push away, he can get plates, so that one Q helps him a lot. Vayne doesn't have wave clear that much, but my wave clear is insane right now. At the same time. I'll make up for it. Let's do some armor, get Iceborne. Once I get Iceborne, I'll be so big. I'm already 450 gold shutdown. Both our soul lanes are inting pretty hard, though. Bot lane's doing fine, I guess. But the soul lanes are not playing again. Like, he's probably gonna die again. Wow, he actually died to this soon. I could just steal his blue. I'm pretty sure. It should be up. Because my red's up. And I think he started blue on this for some reason. He did level 3 top. He couldn't start red and then be level 3 top with double buff. That doesn't make sense. Ah, 
time you almost 2v1 them. That heal and ignite or I would have actually vomited them. Oh dear! Our team is literally want to lose too hard. They're not letting me carry. Like look at their HP bars too, they're so low. Oh, I stunned that guy. Let's go. Let's go. Triple assist. Okay, this thing does so slow. I can just smite it. It's whatever. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, we got it. Fourth. Dude, the good part is, look at my HP again. And I have all my 5 stacks. Alright, this is easily carryable now. I was gonna say it was gonna be impossible to carry if they keep hinting, but now that I'm so fed, I think it's easily possible at this point. Conquer is such a 1v9 rune too. On this champ, once you go like that again. I need to get that item. It's huge. Alright, now I have permit slow. Spirit Visage, and I don't die to their magic damage. And then you can build. Well, I should build Duxy Lace up. Need to stack it up. I don't have smite, but I should be fine. Oh, buddy. Oh, my goodness, man. That freaking thing ability. Oh, I could actually cut him off. Let's go! I, I got him. He's dead. Ah, right, perfect! I'm so strong. They actually can't do anything. The Flash Ignite Jax! Chill, bro. This measure build could be risky, but whatever. If it pops off, it pops hard. I may as well get it. I don't think I'm killable yet. Damn, they have so much MR. I think I might do wood stuff after Visage. Look at my R cooldown, by the way. I just used R, and it's basically back up. Alright. I'm gonna go clear this wave. That vision everywhere, man. It's really hard for me to make plays. That they don't see coming. Any play I'm like attempting, they see it coming from miles away. Push one wave actually. I miss every million though. Right there. Oh, it doesn't matter, whatever. Wow, my Q doesn't one shot these. I don't even know why these people are taking my shot. They really shouldn't take my stuff. Like the red buff, especially. When I'm this fed. It'll be huge on me. I want this blue bad. These freaks are literally trying to take it for some reason. Ooh, baby, baby. This stun came in handy, eh? Alright, that's perfect. Our herald's still up. It's gonna get a good charge. Whatever. That herald's getting a charger there. Look at his healing. So insane. Dude, I love Echo Jungle. For some reason, with this build, Echo Jungle seems so strong. You just have to play the low proper. You have a lot of healing and a lot of tankiness. So even if you get caught, you don't die. It's super difficult for them to kill you. Okay, we got like so much out of this. Sheesh. Gimme, give gimme give everything! I have my visage after this. And then we can do Infernal. Okay, nice. Where's the visage? 2.8k. Perfect gold. Huh. I need to ping the dragon, so maybe we go at it. We must go to dragon. Go, go, go! Is it the mid lane? Of course. This mid laner. He's literally fuming. He lost. Too hard one-on-one. -on -one.
Bro, like, he was asking for assistance, like, don't get me wrong, I obviously want to help him, but... The thing is, you're asking for assistance when your lane is ungankable. That's just troll. You need to think, like, what can an Echo do right there? And then what can his champion do? How are we gonna self a gank when the Syndra is playing, like, with his range? It's just not gonna work, right? Impossible to work. Ah, right, perfect. We got that item too. My measures only give me 119 AP. I actually don't have that much AP at all. These guys are doing my jungle camps instead of fucking... What's it called? Pushing their lane. But it's fine, whatever. At this point, I don't really need my jungle camps. I just need my 16. I love Echo's mobility. Around the map, you run so fast. Never had luck. That is crazy how much this guy's gonna end. Ooh, that thing was perfect. Oh my gosh, you're actually just one recording them. Hey, let's go, baby! He's silenced, he should be dead. Nice, but Ari is only 30 seconds again. B. My R just came up. He had his R, so if he R'd me first before my R, I would have just died. I probably didn't do R back. Look at his R cooldown 20 seconds. Now, this is not even 16. So, like, once it gets 16, it's basically permanently up. Dude, Hank Echo, man. Oh my gosh. It needs a nerf. I think this. Type of build on Echo needs a nerf to be honest with you. Wait, why is my cam frozen again? Come on, man. Ah, I'm tilted. Hey, buddy. Yo, what's good, baby? How you doing? We are back with the offline videos, eh? I'm actually not streaming right now. I'm recording. And to give you, you know, a little heads up, dude. This is the recorded stream after the 24 hour stream. So I basically haven't slept that much yet. I slept like one to two hours to quick nap. Even in the middle stream, but yeah. Now we're playing some games. So, hey, take it easy. I might, you know, make some questionable plays, but I think it'll be fine. I'll try my best to carry this. We're actually leveling up an account quickly to 30, but the good part is on this account, I actually play with good players or higher players. I play with like Diamond 1, Diamond 2, and then like Plat. It, it just mixes. Wait, but since I've won majority of the games on this account, I will be playing with good players, I hope. So it'll be good quality games. Playing against Mundo with Grasp, I'm playing Irelia. We got a Project Irelia skin. They've got Fiddlesticks Jungle, Mundo Top. That's gonna be a hype one. I'm down to see how it goes. Our Kha'Zix is actually doing the Conquer Kha'Zix, which has been happening lately. Ooh, don't get that red buff reset, baby. That's gonna be scary if it does. All right, so, wait a minute, that's, wow. He actually just got no pots. Man is just saving all his gold so he can get the upgraded item. Maybe that's not too bad. Because once he gets the upgraded item, he gets more gold. Maybe that's 500 IQ. Okay, right here, I don't want to trade with the minions that much. Where's his Q? There we go. I need to dodge that Q because he's going to do a lot of damage. So since he already pushed the wave, I was leashing. I need to let this wave push to me. If I try, like, trading with him, the minions will hurt me and then he automatically wins the trade. And he'll get level 2 before me. So, either way, just be patient. Let the wave push. You'll flaunt me down the wave. It's okay. Alright, alright. Our balloon just popped off after dying to the level 1... Invade. Quite good actually. Got the 2v2 kill. Yeah, Talon's a very strong jump level 1 too. Oh, he actually got one kill as Talon too early game. Ooh, it's gonna be a fed Talon, isn't it? I needed to get every minion. I got a better trade on him. Use a pot here. Heal it up. I think the Fiddle 6 will be top side because this guy didn't leash. So I'm assuming Fiddle 6 started red. He will be top very soon. I blocked the minion queue, that's okay. 
actually did that on purpose. Landing E, we can all in here. He's probably dead. Even if he flashes, I have my Q. I'm trying to let him flash and then Q. Nice, perfect. In those scenarios, I want to see if the top lane panic flashes and then that way you get a free kill. It would be perfect setup. But yeah, I think I might do still the off stream videos for you guys. I'll try my best to do every off stream videos as I can. Just because you guys like this content, so I may as well put in more time into it. But yeah, we'll see how it goes. If I don't have time in some days, I mean, then I can't. Because I am going to EU on April 9th. I mean, October 9th, rather. I'll arrive on October 10th, and we're going to play back on the EU and E region. Since we didn't finish last time, we've got to finish it this time. More will come too, actually. Mid Beast is probably already there. Dom is going to come. We're just going to bring the crew. Bring it back. So I'll have 16 days to rank 1, which means my time will be limited in EU as well. I'll have to play long hours. But it should be doable. 16 days. Hopefully it's enough. But yeah, I'm excited to see. You know, the good part is from NA, I only have 110 ping. So if I don't finish it in EU, maybe if I go like rank 2 or something, I can win some games about RNG and then get the rank 1. Okay, nice. We dodge your Q. We just heal up. I have life still ruins. Once I get full HP, I think we can dodge him still. Use another pot just to remain mana on HP. I don't want to use any abilities here. If he walks up to this minion, okay, no. I could use my E, but at the same time, I don't want to waste it. Let's see how this goes. So I have my 5 stacks. I think I can dive in. Okay. I, I, hmm. Really troll. If I landed the E, he would die. And I would actually be able to survive. But yeah, what ended up happening is I missed my E, so I couldn't kill him. Right here, what I want to do is... Avoid the push by a bit. That's fine. You see, I still have TP advantage. So what I would like to do is keep him here. TP with Tiamat. And then keep pushing the wave. So he can back. I'm going to put a ward down so he thinks that I have him back yet. If this minion dies slow, he's dead. And he should be dead. This should be a wrap. By the time I push this wave, I'll be level 6. And I can easily dive in this time around. I mean, he should be dead here actually, rather. I have minion dashes back, perfect, get every minion and then kill the guy. I usually like to have minions in the back when I'm diving somebody so I can dash out if things go bad. Because like last time I had to flash just because I didn't miss my, I mean I didn't land my E. If I had a minion I would just obviously dash back and save my flash. Two plates, get these minions back, I can't get a third one. If I do go for a third one and he comes back he's gonna push the wave and I'll miss the wave and that will not be worth it. Maybe I could have bounced, because he bounced on the minions first. Either way, it doesn't matter. I can get my reset quick. I might sell this to get a Fage. I think that's my best play out here. Get sweepers because the cooldown's too high. What you don't know is, if you swap to sweepers and then swap back to wards, you actually get two wards back by the time sweeper cooldown is up. So like, that's a little trick you can do to keep getting ward trinkets. Okay, their town's getting extremely fed, boys. That's going to be a scary one to deal with. Ballin is... Ooh, he's, he's only 6 in CS. I think this is a 1v5 game, boys. Kha'Zix is doing fine. He's ahead. A little bit. But every other lane except top <coughs> are struggling out here. Which means, no mistake, play perfect. Look, pay attention to the map. And then win the game. So, we'll see how it goes. It's still doable. Just gotta focus up. Right here, this wave actually hasn't reset it. I wanna push the wave so I can reset the next wave and then I can freeze. Because in this wave, it's not going to freeze. There we go. That wave's pushed in. I'm going to get this honey fruit. I don't need to use a pot. I don't think he put a ward down here. He didn't have the time to move out here. He just came back to the lane. That's it. So I'll save my super. Probably get this if it's up. Or get that. So I fit of six can't. She's ganked me. Okay, they're both down. Blue is down too. So it means he was here. Which means he has to go bot side now. Surprisingly, he started blue with no leash rather than doing red with the leash. He still doesn't have his flash. If I can maybe set up a minion, I can set up a long dash like on this minion. Okay. No, no! I, my Q missed. That's so sad. If my Q didn't miss, I would all in them. I think I could have killed him right there. To be honest with you, though, I did not expect my Q to not kill that minion. Oh yeah, since it didn't kill the minion, 
I still win this. I want him to think that he wins this actually. So, wow, he has a splash up again. I think I want to choose to stay here. I'll get the gold. Right, perfect timing. Yeah, the fellow's mid. It's a one on one. No flash. Should be killable. Wow, that cleaver actually reached on me. Can't kill this guy, not yet. Need to back. Okay, yeah, that talent needs to be shut down somehow. I think talent's up. This guy walked up into the bush. That means somebody had to be top. Good thing I didn't cancel my back. Oh wow, Talon was bought. He just walked up there without knowing. Interesting. Okay, maybe he bluffed his way out. I, I actually expected Talon to be top right there, to be honest with you. I thought for sure he would be top. Alright, um, the good part is, now that he doesn't have flash, the next fight I can definitely kill him. I think right here I can chase him down. I don't care about that minion. I can chase him down, yeah. I'm actually gonna flash here. Just to reach... He should be dead. No matter what he does, he should be dead. Okay. That's really sad that I missed my... But he should still be dead. Save your Q till the last second. Perfect. I got the team out proc. He didn't... He uses R and Aftershock, so... Okay. Kazakh didn't finish it. I don't need to stay there. Oh, don't die. One problem is, Talon could actually come double kill us. Oh dear. Okay, well, this guy doesn't have a ward here. I could actually cheese him here, I would say. Depending on how low these minions get. Okay, maybe he can kill him too? Nice, worth, worth, worth. Let's go, baby. He gets a shutdown. I was actually a 400 gold shutdown too, but I think that's worth it because this is a 500 shutdown and he gets a double kill. He might even get first hour. I get my Trinity Force. I did all my marks I could get. I just had no vision of Talon because of his invisibility. He's doing MR against me. That's actually interesting. He's doing the greedy Spirit Visage build so that he can actually heal up fast, but no, he, that, that's not the right build. Because we have the AD jungle, AD top, he should definitely do some park at first. Too greedy to do otherwise. I can go mid and kill this guy now. He doesn't have R, so without his R, I can kill him. I'm pinging him to push it one more wave. I can kill mid, maybe. Oh. Wow, surprisingly, he had his flash. Oh, that's so sad, man. Two flashes already. The Kazakhs had to take it slow so I could actually get there, but he took it too fast. I couldn't get there, yeah. I hate Talon jumps. He's gonna R me. Ooh, Fiddlestick's gonna go from here. Okay, I'd rather mid live mid right now. Oh, I'm so afraid of getting Fiddle Lord. What the? I can't hesitate here. This guy is hovering in the jungle, so maybe Fiddle stop. I think I can cut him off if he goes this way. Let's see if I can cut him off. And he should be dead. I have to kill him fast so he doesn't regen. Perfect. Now this is first tower gold, so that's huge. I just want to get it first, quick. Alright, that's really good. They're fighting mid. I can't want me to do that. I'm just gonna reset. Actually, I can flank, I can flank. Yeah, 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 this can work, this can work. This could work, but at the same time, we need to make sure they get engaged first. Perfect, I killed Talon, I'm coming. Survive one sec. Nice, this should be really good for me, actually. Let's go, so many shutdown goals right there. Okay, good thing we didn't back off and did a flank. That was actually a really good flank. I'm gonna go bot, I have Sterics already, that's... Oof, lovely. 40 minutes, training for Sterics. Completed. I'm gonna be one big threat for enemy team to deal with. We can still carry this game. The more gold I get, the easier I can carry. What I want is bot tower, just cause I already got top tower. And I have like max pressure split push. So, I could get towers fast. And nobody can match me at this point. At all. Level 12, two items. And both items are huge. 40% CD over blue buff. Lots of life steal in case I get low and then one life steal back. So, let's go baby. The only thing is... 
I need to be careful of their CC chain. I think they're gonna send Nautilus Ash. That's good. I could actually kill them in two seconds. Perfect. I can get double, I think. Yeah, should get it. Nice, okay. I have life still. Now we heal it up. I'm surprised I actually dodged the Ashor. If the Ashor hit me, it would be really difficult to kill them. And this guy queued over this wall. So, good thing they missed everything, basically. I can just run away. I don't need to fight here. I may need to flash, depending on how fast it gets. It won't kill me. Alright, let's back. Actually, I have thing buff. Alright, perfect. That guy died too. He actually did a lot of damage. I need my mercs right now. Actually, no, I'd rather go QSS here. It'll be a better item for me to get. Oh, perfect, perfect. I would go for that dive, but I saw talent too late. If I saw talent earlier in mid, I would completely go for it. But you see, it's better to not go for this place if you don't know where, like, you know, enemies are. Because if I die, I'm a 1k gold shutdown. And that guy is what, like a 300 gold support? Not worth my 1k gold shutdown at all. But now, on the other hand... Wow, they FF. Very nice. Surprisingly, they FF. I did not expect that. Dude. Hey, we take those, man. Good game, good game. All right, we have fun. Thanks for watching, boys. I'll be back with another video soon. Let's do it up. All right, see you next game. Peace.